Good evening, everyone. I'm meteorologist Katie McNeil. You've now clicked on the Weather Now link. Let's jump right into it. Taking a look outside, very clear visibility now at this hour. We'll be looking at cooler temperatures overnight tonight with overnight lows settling in the low 50s. So a little bit cooler than what we've seen the past couple of nights with lower dew points accompanying that as well. And as far as conditions go, we're very quiet across the area. We'll head towards another very nice day tomorrow on Monday to start your work week again. The only change really for the start of the day will be those cooler early morning temperatures. So as you're stepping out the door kind of around uh, six, seven o'clock, we'll still see those lingering temperatures into the 50s, but we'll warm up fairly quickly. Lots of sunshine throughout the day with your highs pretty similar to today. Highs inland will be in the upper 70s to around 80 down at the coast, kind of right around that 70 degree mark. But dew points will be a little bit less, so it'll feel more comfortable air wise than what we've seen over the weekend here. And as we head towards the overnight, we'll start to see a build of clouds as high pressure moves farther to our east as we head towards Tuesday, more of a mix of sun and clouds throughout the day on Tuesday. But we'll be staying dry. We are tracking our next uh, potential name storm here. The National Hurricane has upgraded uh, what was originally a disturbance to potential tropical cyclone eight. A little bit of a mouthful there. This is expected to continue to strengthen into what would be Tropical Storm Helene. That's our next name on the list here. There are already tropical storm warnings in place on uh, parts of the coastline of both South and North Carolina. With that, the major question that we have here locally is as of right now, most of the moisture is expected to stay well to our South, but some of that could work its way up towards Southern New England around Thursday timeframe, Wednesday into Thursday. So we'll be keeping a close eye on how this develops. Now, again, not expecting any major impacts here, but we are looking at the chance for some showers around that midweek time frame. So the question will be whether or not we will see some of the moisture from the system in the coming days. So of course, keep checking in with us on that. And let's take a look at your Monday morning here again. In the meantime, conditions very quiet. Lots of sunshine will be a cool start, but we'll warm up fairly quickly as we head towards around midday. Your afternoon highs very seasonably warm, very dry as well with those lower dew points comfortable conditions, lots of sunshine with those highs in the upper 70s to around 80. So again, another gorgeous day on tap for Monday. High pressure will start to move away from southern New England or our area rather uh, as we head towards Tuesday, but still staying dry. That first chance for showers is looking to be Wednesday, but mainly later in the day Wednesday into Thursday. Of course, we'll keep you guys updated in the next couple of days about the exact impacts and what we're expecting. But in the meantime, enjoy a gorgeous start to your work week. And as always, you can get your full forecast anytime at WPRI.com.